Ah, beautiful. Fancy getting your eye in ready for the pheasant season? For the price of a couple of good lessons, you can go on a simulated pheasant day, which are held all over the country during the summer months. Somerset Driven Clay Shooting is running this day on the edge of Exmoor. We travel around, use a lot of different ground we've got here, uh, some really nice deep ground in different areas to uh, create the, the best clays and make it as realistic as possible for those high pheasant drives and uh, partridge drives that we get here in West Somerset. Rich should have been a farmer, and only a farmer, but he loves his shooting. The family have farmed here for, for a number of years, yes, yeah, I'm third generation. I do enjoy shooting a lot, yeah, I've always shot. I shot clays at, at, at uni and uh, I've run a pheasant shoot for a number of years on the farm and uh, now recently started running simulated game days. So these bits of ground that are awkward to uh, do much with farming wise uh, are very, very good for these simulated game days, yes, yeah. A sim day is of course like the biggest pheasant day you can imagine, but with clays. So there is plenty to shoot at. Luckily nobody can see which clays I'm going for, so it's ideal. <laughs> Rich makes sure that the birds are coming in the same kind of unexpected waves you get on a real pheasant shoot. Good place, Keith. Let's have another, another pause and then a big flush, please. The day is organised in drives, just like a pheasant shoot. There is plenty of refreshment between drives, a chance to have a go at each other's shooting and be self-critical. Now It's bound to do me good because I shot like a drain to start with and then I did eventually do a little bit better and then I said to my partner in crime I'm in no roll it and I proceeded to miss the next two so but I'm sure as the day goes on I will improve hopefully if you have a big day coming up this season a sim day nearby is a good way to prepare for it yeah we had some people that um, came down they traveled a couple of hours uh, a group of guns that were going to shoot at Chaga in November um, so they wanted to, to test themselves out on the on the high birds that we've got we've got some ground that we own right next to Coombe Sydenham shoot and uh, we did those drives for that particular team that day and uh, it worked well they you know they really enjoyed it and they're talking about coming back on another day later this month as, a, as an extra practice day. This is also a great opportunity to try out new kit. One of the guns turns up in an unusual vehicle for a shooter but maybe we'll see more of these. It's a battery-powered six-seater Tesla and he likes it except for one aspect. I think it'll take up as a great shoot vehicle for guns. Unfortunately, if you're a gun who likes to have a dog with him, it might not be quite so convenient. You think they could fix that? I think they could. I think you have to make, make sure you don't go for the six either. We'll go for the seven or the five. And uh, yeah, that's that problem solved. You just put a dog guard in the back. It'll be quite interesting to see if I get out of this particular field today. If we have a shower of rain, I've got no problem. <laughs> no problem. But, uh, everybody else will have a problem as well if, if it does rain. Yeah. The good news is that it doesn't rain, and the Tesla makes short and silent work of the steep Brendan Hills. We are out at the end of August, which is almost the end of the simulated game season. Uh, we start in mid-March, um, leave it a month or six weeks after the end of the season, and then uh, we start then and, and go right the way through until the end of September. And then we switch over to pheasant shooting at the begin, uh, middle of October. Um, but this time of year we use drives away from our pens of birds just so we're not disturbing the birds too much but they seem to get along with it pretty well. You can come as a group or as an individual. This shoot is £145 per gun per day and you will probably spend the same again on the 500 fibre wad cartridges you will probably shoot most of. For more search for Somerset Driven Clay Shooting on Facebook.